Hey you guys and welcome back to Sophia Monet Tarot. It's your girl Sophia Monet. I'm coming back to do your energy readings between you and your person for February 2021. And this is for Libra, okay? So we're going to see the mutual energies between you and your person, how you feel about your person, how they feel about you, and the outcome, okay? I am using a new deck. It's called the Radiant Wise Spirit Tarot right over here in the background you may notice that my background is a little different i have been in the process of moving so thank you all for being patient with me as i make this transition i have been so busy you guys so thank you again for being patient with me and uh, of course i wanted to do love readings because it is february so let's see what's going on with you and your person Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What's the mutual energy between Libra and their person for this month? Oh, okay, two popped out. I won't take them, but we have the Knight of Swords and Temperance. So someone could be getting very impatient. Someone is impatient, is what I feel. What's the mutual energy? Queen of Wands, Queen of Wands. Mm, there could be some very fiery energy going on between the two of you. Um, there could be choice words or both of you could be wanting control. Both of you could be taking action to get something done between the two of you. Yeah, at the bottom of the deck, you could be making a decision about this relationship. Okay, and let's see. What's your energy towards your person? What's Libra's energy toward their person? The will of fortune, okay? So you could be wanting to move on or thinking about the future, but feeling anxiety about moving forward with this person for some reason. What is their energy toward you? What is their energy toward you, Libra? Whoa, what slipped out? Temperance again, so it was meant to come out. This person could be needing balance in some way, needing to find emotional balance. They could be waiting on something to happen. Four of Cups, they could be feeling rejected or rejecting an, an offer from you. Okay. They could be avoiding you as well. What's the outcome between Libra and their person? What's the outcome between Libra and their person? We have the World card. So there could be a cycle completing um, between you and this person. There could be something that you're closing out. You and this person are closing out with each other. Five of Swords, the two of you may be in some type of battle. Um, a play on words is what I'm getting as well. Yeah, the two of you could be spying on each other, watching what each other um, is doing in this situation with the Page of Swords energy right behind the Five of Swords. So let's see, why Why are you got <laughs> Ten of Swords popped out? Yeah, the two of you, I was about to clarify the mutual energy, um, why the Queen of Wands came out as mutual. Yeah, so the two of you could be trying to get over a betrayal. The two of you could be trying to, yeah, heal from this. Something happened, something ended, something broke up. I feel like uh, there's a power struggle between you and this person. There's a power struggle, okay? What else we got? The Three of Cups. Yeah, it could have been a third party. And the, the Eight of Cups. Mm. Some truth or clarity is coming to this situation this month. Yeah. We have the Ten of Swords, the Three of Cups, and then the Eight of Cups. So it's like some someone is feeling like the best thing to do is to walk away from this. You could also feel like this Queen of Wands person. There, this could be an actual person and not just an energy. This could be someone coming in between um, the two of you. But I do sense with that Eight of Cups that the two of you are walking away from reconciling right now. Yeah, 
So why is the Wheel of Fortune your energy toward your person? Why is the Wheel of Fortune here for Libra? Why is the Wheel... Oh, wow. Hanged Man Reversed popped out. Yeah, you're getting unstuck. You want to set yourself free. You're getting unstuck from this. Okay, you're not hanging around anymore. The hanged man, he hangs around, tries to understand and, you know, get, have patience. And when it's in reverse, it's like, I have a bright idea. You see that circle around his head? It's like, I have a bright idea and I'm becoming unstuck. So I feel like you're wanting to move forward. Look at the bottom of the deck, five of cups. You're tired of being sad. Three of wands, seven of swords. Yeah. I feel like you're waiting for something better. You're waiting for your ships to come in. When it comes to this person, seven of swords, um, you could be trying to get away. You could feel like this person um, is doing something sneaky or um, in the past, this person could have put you in the five of cups energy. Some of you could have children with this person. This could definitely be a marriage. Uh, the children card, six of cups energy. You did have a past like soulmate connection with this person. And then the higher font right after. Yeah, this could be a marriage for some of you. This could be a marriage that um, got a lot of attention or recognition as well. Okay, and why is the temperance here for your person? Why is temperance here for your person? Why are they feeling temperance when it comes to this situation? What we got? Okay, the magician. Yeah, Gemini energy is here. The nine of pentacles. Yeah, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. And then the page of cups. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so what do they want? It's like... This person, it's like they're trying to manifest being single. But then Page of Cups, they they want to communicate to you. I feel like this is what I want to say. I feel like this person is trying to figure out how to get back in good with you. And it may be a little too late. With the Magician, they're trying to figure out. It's like they have a trick up their sleeve. When you get the magician, a little bit of manipulation going on. They're trying to figure out how to win you. They see you as like, oh my gosh, this person may leave me. This person is a good catch. This person may leave. And so let me, Page of Cups, let me come in. Let me say something. Let me apologize. Let me say something to this person to get them to change their mind about me or to get them to leave. Yeah, seven of wands at the bottom of the deck. Like, they want to block you from leaving. Yeah, chariot. <laughs> chariot is movement. Someone is leaving. Someone is getting in their car and leaving. And the emperor right behind it. This could be a husband. Um, this could, If it's a woman, it could also be a, a wife that is very controlling. But I feel like this is your person feeling a very masculine energy here. This person wants to have control over the narrative. They don't want you to go. They're literally standing like in front of your car, like don't move, don't leave, don't pack your stuff, don't leave this marriage, don't leave this relationship, okay? And let's see, why is the world card the outcome for you and your person, Libra? Why is the world card the outcome? Why is the world card the outcome? for you and your person what we got okay the six of wands the tower and then the six of pentacles two sixes oh okay mm. yeah this this is going to end and it may not end well with the six of wands the it's like the two of you are becoming arrogant with each other you both want a victory Neither one of you is willing to back down or compromise. The tower, Scorpio energy, something falls apart. Something is torn down. The foundations are literally sh shaken in this relationship. And then the six of pentacles, court, um, 
court battles, fighting over money, fighting over property as well. When you get the Six of Pentacles with the tower, something blows up in someone's face. And look, Hermit at the bottom of the deck. Hermit. So for the outcome, it's like the two of you will not be speaking. Once this is over, the two of you will not be speaking, not communicating. Um, but yeah, I see something blowing up. Someone having to give lots of money away. Someone losing money. See, in the Six of Pentacles, it's like everyone has their hand out. And this person is having to give a lot, okay? Having to give a lot of their money away. Um, someone, you could be taking someone to court for child support or something like that. What else does Libra need to know in this situation for February 2021 with them and their person? What else does Libra need to know in this situation? Okay, we had two flip over. Yeah, someone has a third party. Look at this. The devil with the three of pentacles. There could be another person involved in this for sure. This is what you need to know. Okay. Uh, you could have already found this out. And this is why the two of you. This is why the seven of swords is here for your energy toward your person. You feel like they're sneaky or they're doing something behind your back. Um, and I feel like with the devil energy and the three of pentacles. Um, there's definitely, it's like you, uh, seeking out a lawyer, you, you taking this person to court, they could be trying to take you to court to fight you for something. Um, I feel like there's other people involved as well. There could be gossip going on. Um, the two of you may have assets together. Um, like you may have a business. That's what I want to say. You may have a business together. And the two of you have to work something out, even though you don't want to. You have to work something out. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck with the King of Pentacles. Money, money, money. Big, big money involved in this, okay? Yeah, you could be uh, also waiting on a solid offer from someone else. Some of you are moving on to another person as well. But with that devil energy and the three of pentacles, something here is very devious. Something here, someone has, uh, I keep getting gossip. Someone is like telling their family what's going on, like telling business to, telling your personal business to family. This could be you or your person, okay? But there is the energy of that going on. So let's get some romance angels. What's the advice here? Whoa, what flew out? worth waiting for yeah i feel it over here someone your person i feel like they don't want you to go i feel like they don't want you to go they're trying to apologize with that page of cups like okay i'm sorry okay okay give give me some more time with that temperance card they want you to be patient with them give me some more time you know just wait a minute they want you to wait. Yeah. And you're like, uh-uh. You've been enlightened about something with that hangman in reverse. It's like, no, I'm not sticking around for this. Okay. Let's get some more. What's the advice? Past life relationship. Yeah. It's like you two have known each other before. Um... There's a deep connection here between you and this person, but I, I feel like this is the reason why they don't want to let you go. They, they're afraid that you're going to leave. I feel like this person is afraid. Okay, that was like way too many cards, but the one that did fly out first, soulmate in reverse. Yeah. I feel like you you are in this sad energy of you feel like you're losing your soulmate. You feel like you've lost this person. That past life relationship that you once had, that deep connection is dwindling. Yeah, this could be the one. Now, like I said, some of you are moving on to new love. Some of you have already found another stable, dependable person. 
And um, this is coming out for a lot of of the signs where they have already found someone else for not just Libra, but um, for other signs. Okay. And yeah, for some of you, I feel like your person puts you in a third party Libra and now they want to come back and apologize. Now they see your worth nine of pentacles. Now they want to work, work it out and try but I feel like, you know, you've had enough and you don't want it. Okay. I feel like you've had enough. Libra is finally done. You've been through a lot with this person. I can tell. Okay. So tell me, what's the advice? Let's get an angel oracle. What's the advice in this situation? Trust. It says trust. Some of you need to trust yourselves. This is what I feel. Because sometimes when I get this card, it depends on what the reading is or what the vibe is. But in this reading, I feel like you need to trust yourself. Trust your intuition that you're making the right moves. Because I feel like something is devious with this person. That Seven of Swords feeling that you feel toward them. Yeah. With that devil in the Three of Pentacles. This person could be very unstable when it comes to finances, very unstable when it comes to their home life or the way they do something at home. Like I said, they could be gossiping too much or telling people your business, putting things out there that are not true. It says, let go at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, that's the advice. Trust and let go. Some of you are letting go. I see it right here in the outcome. Remember the six of wands. It's like you're going to get on your high horse and you're like, no, nope, I'm ending this and I'm going to take your ass to court and we're going to be done with this. We're going to be done because that's what Libra does. Libra takes people to court. Okay. And there, <laughs> you are justice. That's your uh, major arcana is the justice card okay so libra is all about the judicial system courts court documents libra rules that libra is all about fairness and balance and you feel like the scales are not tipping in your favor in this relationship anymore and you're you're about to let it go you're about to let it go Alrighty, you guys, so that is your energy for you and your person for the month of February 2021 for the month of love. And I hope this resonated. If it did not, maybe next time, okay? Don't forget to like this video. Give me a thumbs up. Also, share this video and subscribe to my channel, Sophia Monetero. I look forward to hearing from you. Have a great month. Bye.